go to Visual Studio and right click close all but this this controller go to index go to view and here we don't need this HTML markup code the default code what Visual Studio gave us let's write few code to show the course inside panel so div class container div tag the class name row I'm just following the bootstrap code so here the h2 tag the header and this text will be text center it will be showed in the center of the page and text will be courses that you teach let's write horizontal align for each code variable item in the model this model contains the list of course and this will be looped through and div class the grid layout for a small size this is 3 and extra small size it will be 4 so 4 into 3 12 so div class panel panel header no panel default another div tag here need to be specified the class and this is panel thumbnail I believe this bootstrap class not exist anyway we can use this no problem anchor tag this is sp dash action here need to specify the action method in rule this action method we will create later to enroll this course actually and this is sp route the route id equal at item dot course id and another HTML tag is image and image will display here and search will be item item dot image path and the class equal okay I need to specify height and width height is 150 pixels and width 250 pixels at the end of this default panel div tag we need to write another code okay panel thumbnail div class panel panel body here I need to specify the other properties the class lead here we can show item title item dot title and here the revenue item dot revenue and 
here item dot description and this index page only teacher can access so here we need to specify edit course ankle link so edit course and href need to be sp action edit this sp dash action and route will generate the href automatically h sp route id item dot course id that's it so class we need to specify button button default hit enter that's it let's refresh this page here you can see the user the teacher can see this page copy this one no need to write close this debugging need to write code for another action method and this index action method logic need to be changed because this page belongs to teacher so context dot okay copy this one and paste it at the top and name it as browse and this action method is open for all so this will be for showing all the courses let's cut this and this will be the context dot courses and it will show all the courses and at the top need to specify allow anonymous attribute so that any user even log without login the user can see this page at this index action method need to find out the user id so user id equal user manager dot get user id from user object and here need to specify underscore context dot courses dot where the the teacher id equal user id only teacher corresponding teacher can see their courses at this view page that's the logic so go to this need to create the view for browse create the browse view it's scaffolding from t4 template and need to copy few code from index so copy this whole HTML copy and paste cop here need to change few things first of all need to title is browse and courses all courses this will be and this is looping people can click enroll and revenue report we cannot see here we cannot show here so this is the price the student will see this one description here and edit course cannot be applicable from the students let's run this project let's 
let's refresh this page. So browse course, you can see. Let's log out and browse course, you can see. The normal user can see this. And if you cre create new link, you cannot, you need to log in first. So, log in, then you can create.